Hi Diamond Friends, it's Linda. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for visiting. I really appreciate it. Uh, today I wanted to share with you um, two unboxings from Dreamer Designs. I did the Welcome 50, so I was able to buy one, get one at half price. I have already ordered before from them and that's like a when you're doing your first order. So I emailed them to ask if I could use that first and they said as long as I hadn't used it, which I didn't, I could use the code. So even though I ordered from them, so they, they let me go ahead and use it. <clears throat> Excuse me. So that was really nice of them. So I checked to make sure I didn't use it before I bought these. Um, so yeah, so I was able to get one at buy one, get one at half price, so that was fun. And that's the reason why I was able to get these two. So yeah, because my one of my sons owed me some money for, for something. And so instead of paying me back in cash, he just paid me back in diamond paintings. <laughs> so that's like even extra fun. So I also wanted to update you. Um, for those of you who follow my channel, it's been a, I think it was like a month ago that I did an unboxing of a Dreamer Design canvas and it was that owl on a tree. And my canvas had smudges on it. So I did email them with lots of pictures. I took pictures of all these sections with the smudges. And they emailed me back and said, well, is it the whole canvas or is it part of the canvas? And I said, it's parts of the canvas. <clears throat> Excuse me. So then they emailed me back and they sent me like a picture um, of, the can of the image with all the symbols on it and the grid and everything like that. Just, it was, a, it looked exactly like the canvas. And they just, and they just told me that I could use that as a reference to where the smudges were. And I emailed them back and, you know, I was polite about it. And I said, you know, that doesn't work for me because I have, um, number one, my eyes are old and it's hard for me to see. And number two, you know what? I'm going to turn that off. I forgot to turn the air conditioner off. So let me go do that real quick. I feel like I'm yelling at you all just trying to talk above the air conditioner so and I just forgot to turn it off but I said um <clears throat> my I have a hard time seeing I wear my glasses and um having to pull up my computer and zoom into those spots to make sure I'm putting the the diamonds in the right spot I told them that's just not enjoyable for me I want to be able to look forward to the kit not dread the kit excuse me <coughs> oh, I'm still getting over that cold. So um, I just let them know that that doesn't work for me. If I could please just have another canvas sent to me. I told them they don't have to send the drills or anything like that. Just the canvas is, is all I need. So they got back to me and they said um, that they'll send out another kit. So basically they sent out a whole new kit. And so I was happy with that, of course, because now I have my new canvas. And when I do pull that out to work on it, it's going to be enjoyable. So I thought that was really kind of them. So thankfully I got it replaced. Um, and <clears throat> hopefully they take those pictures to their manufacturer and let them know that they had to send out another canvas because that way they could kind of like get credit. I would hope that they could do something like that. Uh, maybe like at a, a monthly thing, I don't know. But hopefully they do because I know it wasn't their fault but it wasn't my fault either. And so I just, I just want, I just want to work on the canvas and enjoy it, not have to think about pulling out my laptop, zooming in on spots and things like that. So anyway, so let's go ahead and get to these unboxings. These are both um, some of their newer kits that they got. And I was looking at this one. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? I was looking at this one, but I couldn't get it when it came out. So I was hoping it wouldn't sell out. But then I was like, when am I going to get it? Because I need to really you know, um, slow down with buying my diamond paintings. But thankfully my son owed me some money, so it worked out. <laughs> so we're gonna unbox this one. I took the plastic off since I found out they don't really save my um, boxes. If you watched my last little video, it was like a seven minute video showing you what happened when my boxes got wet, even though I, I saved the, um, the plastic that comes on here. So I already took that off, but I haven't opened these, you guys. I these came like last week and I really wanted to dig into them and look at them but I thought no I'll just wait until I do my unboxing and I know I wanted to do my 
unboxing pretty soon because just in case there's anything wrong with them, I you can email the company right away. <clears throat> like, you know, like last time with the smudges. So I have had these less than a week, but they were just sitting in the living room staring at me. So this is the Dreamer Design box. You get a handle right here and um, it says why diamond paint and it gives you the reasons. And then there's their website and it has this pretty image of the diamonds being placed and how it works and diamonds and canvas kit contents. And E rated for everyone, Dreamers Design. <clears throat> okay, I apologize that I'm gonna be clearing my throat a lot. And I like that they come in these nice um, bags and it has their, their logo here and they close like this. So let's get this out. The only thing though is if these were, if you watched that last video, I share that my, <clears throat> my diamond paintings were sitting like this on the floor and I had like five, I think. Um, the only thing is since this doesn't have that plastic covering, these ones, if they were sitting there would have got probably wet. I don't know what would have happened to them when they, if they would have got wet like that, but but they have a beautiful presentation. You get your, your uh, little bag of goodies here. Or your toolkit. I tell you the words are just not coming out. So we'll look at the toolkit um, in just a second. But we'll open up this so we could have this as a pretty background. <clears throat> the canvas is really nice. And it's scalloped right here and has a poked. So uh, that helps with the fraying so we don't get fraying. It has a beautiful ribbon right here that you could save. And then there's a drill sticking out. That's one set of drills. We've got two, near two bags of drills. And this is a square. And you can see the bags have their, um, their logo on it. So that's really nice. And it says Cinderella's Castle Two of One. So I believe that means there's two bags. So if you, this is two of two. So if you um, don't put your canvases back in the boxes, if you hang them up or put them in a drawer or however you store them. So let's go ahead and <clears throat> So as you can see, it says Cinderella's Castle, Ruth Sanderson. So these are all licensed, legally licensed. And you know what's so funny is I fell in love with this image and it looked familiar to me. Uh, not the image, but the style of the artist. And I'll tell you more about that in a little bit when I unbox the other one. Let's just go like this. Look at, I'm actually doing it. Remember I used, to, I used to always be struggling with the canvases. <clears throat> I'm so sorry about that, you guys, if you're wearing headsets. So let's just do that. Look at, I did it without struggling this time. Maybe I'm becoming a, a real YouTuber now. <laughs> okay, so let's see if that will stay. Oh my goodness, I have to cough, you guys. I'm really trying not to. I wonder if I could do that with this, if it'll roll back a little bit without getting the stickers <clears throat> coming off. Let's let's try it, and we'll just go like this, very carefully. I don't know if that's gonna work, but oh well. We'll just try it out. Okay, so here's the sticker. Isn't that just gorgeous? And it's a square. Size is 60 by 90 centimeters. 23 by 35 inches you have your start and your end date and I love diamond painting you have all these fun little stickers and this one is 63 colors with one two three four five six a B's one two three four five six yep I got that right it's so pretty and it has the, the name and the artist Dreamer Designs on the top. So you get that. You can put this in your logbook. <clears throat> and what I love about Dreamer's Design is their boxes already have 
the image on the box. So, so what I do is even though this is upside down, I'll cl close it and then I'll have this part facing up. Cause my, the way I, well, I guess it depends on where I'm storing. I have different, <laughs> different um, areas, but if I'm standing it up, I will uh, put it upside down and have this facing. If not, then I just lay it down like that. But anyway, <clears throat> excuse me. I like that they have the sticker on the outside of the box right there for you. Then you get your little instructions and kind of like a thank you and all that in here. Tips and tricks. Thank you for your purchase. Instructions. You get your your thank you. Oh, I got to cough again. <coughs> I hope I cough far away enough so that it's not like directly in your ear. Okay. Maybe I will get a drink of water right now. <clears throat> Isn't this gorgeous? Let's go like that. I really like this one because of all the colors. I, if you follow my channel, you know I've mentioned that I want to get more um, bright colors. I have a lot of... Um, let me get a drink of water. I have a lot of canvases with more of the darker colors because of... Uh, landscapes and things like that. Let me get a drink. I'm so sorry. I wish I would have filled up my water bottle because I'm almost done with it. <coughs> I tell you, this cold. I've had it for a week and it just has tired me out. <clears throat> Okay, but isn't this gorgeous? Look at the, the trees and the sky. Oh my goodness, you guys. Let me pause this for a second. Okay, sorry about that. I just had a really, I had a coughing attack, so I didn't want to cough all during the video. And I went and got more water, so hopefully that will help. So anyway, you get Paint With Passion on the bottom. <clears throat> you get their logo again. You have their Dreamers warranty. And it shows that you have to... Okay, hopefully I won't have to um, keep stopping the camera. <clears throat> My goodness. And then Canvas. It has like the little sparklies in there. I don't know if you can see that right there. And get your legend right here on both sides and you get the number symbol and DMC code <clears throat> and on the top you have again I showed you at the beginning all their social media over here so isn't that gorgeous I know I say this with everyone, but I can't wait to do this one. Oh my goodness, it's gonna be so beautiful. Look at the castle, the waterfall, all those pink trees. <clears throat> gorgeous, I tell you, it's just simply gorgeous. And there's a path right here with like water lilies in there. And carriage right here. Oh my goodness, this is so beautiful, y'all. Okay, so here are the beautiful drills. Oh, I still want to get this up. Look at all those beautiful colors. So I have a lot of canvases that have <clears throat> um, a lot of greens. I guess this one's going to have a lot of greens, too. Here's more of the darker colors. So those ABs, I wonder if they have them in one. Oh, look at these beautiful colors. Oh, look at there's an AB. There's another one. I think that's one right there. And then there's one right there. You see. So the ABs. <clears throat> AB stands for Aurora Borealis. And those drills have a special coating on them that make them extra sparkly. Let's, let's see if we could find those ones again. See, like, so 
So maybe I'll just open this up. I know we still got to get the other canvas. Oh my goodness, the other canvas is so pretty. And I got to tell you why I, um, about the <clears throat> recognizing the style. Okay, so let's go ahead. Here's the ABC, that extra sparkly right there. <clears throat> Um, there's that one down there. They're all so sparkly. But, yeah, the ABs have that extra sparkle to them. Okay, let's close that up. I know some of you don't like that sound. Okay, so let's open up the other one. I didn't want to go through the hole trying to find the ABs because you know how I'm so terrible at that. <clears throat> oh my goodness, look at this. So I'm still new to diamond painting. I um I am doing a landscaping right now. I finished uh three diamond art club canvases and a craftably right now. <clears throat> I don't know, still call I still call myself new because I haven't done like things like with a whole whole bunch of confetti like this right here. So there's some confetti heavy areas. And then, I guess this is more called like line blocking. You, just, you are changing colors, but it's not like like over here. And then up here is more color blocking. Is line blocking and color blocking different? I'm thinking it is because this one's more color blocking where you get a lot of the same color. The symbols are really nice. So this is this is color blocking. So there's a lot of areas where there's um, a good amount of color blocking. I need to start learning how to use a 15, is it a 15 placer? And then this is more confetti over here. So that is what that is. <clears throat> Try not to. I'm trying my best not to get the camera because it's right here, the um, stand. So we'll have that as our background. And let's go ahead and look at the next one. Okay, so then this one was the <clears throat> um, newest release when I bought it. It was up for only a couple of hours. And I just said, oh my goodness, I love that image. Look how beautiful it's fall. See how this one's probably going to have more of the darker colors, I would think, with all those leaves and, and stuff, but we'll see. But then I saw, oh, it's Ruth Sanderson. So Ruth Sanderson also has coloring books. So I have a few of her coloring books. And so I think that's why I love these. I, I didn't realize this was her art when I first saw it with both of these. Oh my goodness, I gotta cough again. <clears throat> Let me get some water. Oh, thank you all for sticking with me. If you're still here, put an emoji down with one of those sick emojis, like they're blowing their nose or with a temperature, with a thermometer in their mouth or, <clears throat> you know, with their bandaged head. <laughs> And if you don't have any emojis, I know there are some viewers that can't do emojis, then um, I don't know, can we, maybe we could do like, uh, get better words, get better. <laughs> if you're still here, just so I know, I know these can kind of get long and there's a lot of, probably a lot of you who get bored before you even get to this section of the video. So <clears throat> I'm so sorry, you guys. Maybe I should have just waited to make this video and just had taken them out to make sure they were okay instead. Uh, so yeah, so I I think what I what happened is I recognized the artwork, and you know of course I loved it because I was already had some coloring books with this artist, so I was familiar with her. So yeah, so that was pretty neat. So when I saw the name of the artist, I was like, no wonder I'm just in love with this. I've already, I've, I have coloring books of, of her work. <clears throat> we never did look at the toolkit, huh? So let's go ahead and open one. I believe everything's the same in the toolkit, but let's look just to make sure. 
So these are the newer tool kits. They used to be um, smaller. They had smaller trays, but now you get these really nice trays. And you know, these trays are, I really like these trays. They do work well. So let's see, we've got everything. <clears throat> so basically they are the same. There's like no washi tape or anything like that or cover minders. So, and I know a lot of you don't like these clear, thicker, let's see if I could get this to focus. <clears throat> these clear thicker ones but I actually really love these 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 I like using <clears throat> so I'm always happy to get these because I can't find these on you know to buy like a whole bunch of these multiples of them <clears throat> okay so let's see what's in this goodies so you have your tweezers and I can't remember if you get tweezers with the rounds some companies you only get tweezers with the square canvases so i can't remember if that's how it is with dreamers design but they come with this little cover so make sure you keep the cover because these are very sharp you don't want little kids getting a hold of these so make sure you put them up you get little baggies so if you want to kit up or kit down with with um these or um yeah just use them for whatever they're kind of i'm the baggies that you get with your canvases are kind of flimsy. I mean, thankful that they get you get them so we can kit up if we need to. But yeah, they are kind of like thin ones. <clears throat> and then you have two of these. And I really like that they come in these little caddy things because you could use these for other things because they screw on and the lid's not going to fall off. And then they, you get your little your wax here. And you want to peel back the plastic before you stab it with your pen. And I always just peel off the top one and I leave the bottom. Like I'll peel off the top but leave the bottom so when I'm stabbing it I'm not like scratching the plastic right here. <clears throat> okay, so I'm going to pause you one more time. I, I'm going to come back. I'll be just a second. Okay, I know that was just a second for you all, but um, that was like, <laughs> oh, at least my coughing fit is gone. I, I was getting a phone call, so I thought I'd better answer that. I wasn't sure how it affects the video, so. Okay, we're back. Thank you again so much for sticking with me. I feel like I should just stop this and start all over, but I've already taken all the canvas out, so I guess it just, you know, it's real life here. I, I don't just, even though I don't have a whole lot of kids coming in and out of the house anymore because they're, I mean, the bedroom, um, yeah, things still happen. So that's this video. So anyway, yeah, I really like these because, um, these screw on and off and you could use them for other things when you're done. So I like that they, they have that. And you get this little, um, <clears throat> this little, I call it a little broom, <laughs> but, um, you know, you could, you could get the dust off your canvas. You can use these to scrape drills down. Honestly, um, it's just easier to use my finger to get the drills down. But it's nice that they, you know, include it. And I use, do use this side of the, of the little broom. And then you get your comfort grips. You get two because you have two pens here. So one is with the, um, the single placer. The, is that brass? I forget the brass tip. And then I forget what the name of that metal is, so I apologize about that. And then the other one, which is a lot of people use for ABs, and myself included when I'm doing single placing of ABs. And then you can add some of these other, here's a straightener. So you could put that on the other side if you like to straighten things, put that there. And then you also have some other tips. So this one is, I think this is a three placer and like a six or seven placer. I'm not exactly sure, but that's what this one is. But yeah, I really like these. I like these. I know a lot of people don't like the wide ones. <clears throat> and you got your tray right here. This could snap up. And then when you need to get your drills out, although I haven't used one with this snap, the, my last one, this actually slides up and down. So I'm not sure how that will work with your drills. Do they get caught right here? I wonder, I guess. So I haven't used one with this um, little tab right here. The ones that I got, this comes up like this. So 
I'll have to try that out and see how that works. And then these are dividers, which again, I haven't used. And you just put them in here like this. So you could use different colors when you're doing confetti heavy areas, if you like. But again, I haven't used these. So, but it, the trays themselves are really nice. I have used the trays. Okay, so that is what is in both of these. Since there's no like different kind of washi tape and all that, we won't open up the other one. Let's go ahead and look at this beautiful canvas. I can't wait. I'm just trying to steady my breathing so I don't get another coughing fit. <clears throat> so what are you all working on? Please let me know in the comments. Oh, great. I don't understand it. I was talking on the phone. And I wasn't coughing, but now that I'm doing the video, it's just all... No, I need to cough again. Okay, so again, here's so pretty. <clears throat> Let's take this gorgeous ribbon off. And what's nice is the ribbon is not, it doesn't have the logo on it. So you can save this and use it for um, <clears throat> a gift or something. Okay, so let's do this. Oops, didn't see these little multi-placers here. I just really like those. So if you know where to get those, like on Amazon or something, um, can you please let me know in the comments? Because I really would like to buy more. Okay, so here is the legend. This has 66 colors. So let's go like that. Now that I'm becoming a professional at this. all those pretty colors so this one's going to be one of those ones with a lot of browns some of the darker colors it's got a little bit um creased right there that's okay as long as as long as nothing's wrong with the canvas where the picture is going to be the image i'm okay <clears throat> So, ta-da, here it is. Let's see, do I have it upside down? Yep. So that is a beautiful image. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh my goodness, it's so beautiful. So this one has one, two, three, four, five, six ABs as well. And then you get your little book. <clears throat> And here are the beautiful colors. So this one's going to have a lot of different oranges and browns. So as you can see, the color palette's a little bit more dark. So when I mean dark, I mean the actual color, not like dark images. Let's see. So this one, yes, it does have, there's one that it's, I saw it didn't have any 310s. But, yep, those are the colors. And let's open up this beautiful canvas to see <clears throat> what it looks like. Let's see. Oops. I love how these just, they just lie flat so fast. So this one is a 90 by 60 centimeters and 35 by 23 inches. So let's see, let's put it next to this one like this. Let's see. So it's about the, yeah, it looks like it's the same, same size. <clears throat> These canvases are so, they just, I love them. They just lie flat so fast. Although this one's under some drills over here. So this is it, isn't it gorgeous? And then we have this beautiful tree over here. Oh no, the itches are coming back in my throat. We have this gorgeous tree, this beautiful fairy, some more trees over there. <coughs> Let me get a drink of water. Oh, 
I was so strange, you guys. I was on the phone. No coffee. <clears throat> so I'm not sure why that is. So this is Fall Fairy. Oh my goodness. This is just so gorgeous, you guys. She has her, her books sold on Amazon. She also has illustrated books. So you get all her art in, um, <clears throat> in color. So it's really nice. She's, she's very talented. And look at these. Like the leaves are falling right here. And her dress. I wonder if I should start this one in October. My birthday. Oh, look at my birthday's in October. These are little um <clears throat> like fairies. Let's see. You see that there's little fairies hidden in here, or little elves, or something like that. I can't remember. Let's see. You see, there's like a little a little fairy right there, and then there's something in there, and then there's one here, I believe. So you have little fairies or elves or something. I can't remember exactly what they were when I saw them on the computer. But they're like hidden throughout. <clears throat> I had another one in mind to start in October because I'm not a fast diamond painter. So, you know, it takes me a while to complete one. Um, <clears throat> how many hours a day do y'all diamond paint? Just out of curiosity. So, um, yeah, so like a little section like this will take me, you know, an hour. So you can imagine how long it takes me to do this whole, was that in frame? I don't even know. Like, um, the, there's like Bella trays or the smaller trays, the essential trays. And, um, I, it's kind of how I've been sectioning off my canvas. And so <clears throat> with the size of that Bella art tray, it takes me about an hour to do. So I had another one in mind to do this fall, one from Craftably, but I'm thinking maybe I should do this one. This one's so pretty. So many diamond paintings to choose from. Their canvases are really nice though. I mean, the, I haven't worked on one, but just the feel of it, um, you know, it feels really nice. Well, that is it for me. I have, um, I gotta put all this away and <clears throat> of course, after I'm all done, oh, my stomach just growled really loud. <laughs> I need to get something to eat. I'm probably gonna go get some sourdough bread that I bought um, and toast it with lots of butter. Do you like sourdough bread with lots of butter? Oh, it's so good. And then I have these green olives in the fridge. I'm probably gonna have some of that. Yep, a feast there with <laughs> sourdough bread and green olives. <clears throat> And then we'll see how that goes. So that is it. I'm so sorry about this video. I know I need to stop apologizing as well, but I just uh, feel like it was just not a very good video with all my coughing and yeah, but this one is just so pretty. It's so gorgeous. But anyway, so I know I already mentioned in emojis, like if, if um, but if you made it to the end, if you can add on to that emoji and add some fall leaves or something fallish or a fairy and you know, something to do or a tree, there's so many, um, yeah, or a little mushroom. <laughs> I know I'm going overboard here, but you know, just something to go that goes with this canvas. <clears throat> and I guess I'll let you guys go, although I really enjoy visiting with you all. So hopefully y'all still here to the end, which many videos I do watch to the end. I watch to the very end because I really enjoy them and I'm usually watching them with um, Lion Diamond Painting. And um, if they don't have a lot of ads, then I'll watch them while I do something else. But usually if there are ads in between, I kind of know which, um, which YouTube videos are going to have like the ads. Then I just do it while I'm diamond painting because when the ads come up, it's too hard if I'm doing the dishes to you know, your hands are wet. I don't have a dishwasher, so I'm the dishwasher <clears throat> to skip the ads. So I usually, I usually uh, listen to everybody while I'm diamond painting. 
And sometimes I'll use that as my timer. If I forgot to put my timer on, I, I like to use my timer, but if I do forget, I will, um, I will use the video I'm watching as my timer. So I'll know that if the video was 30 minutes, I, I diamond painted for 30 minutes. Just checking something. Oh, my stomach is so hungry. I was just checking these things out. That looks good. <clears throat> so anyway, so yeah. So I haven't clicked off because I enjoy visiting with you guys. <laughs> have fun. I don't have anyone else to talk to with about diamond painting. So if you're not here, that's fine too. I'll just be talking to myself, but I won't know it right. Look how nicely these just roll up. It's so pretty. I love this. Look at all these colors. So I want to get faster at diamond painting, not to be like a speedster, um, but just because I want to get through my diamond paintings. I just want to work on so many, you guys. I just want to work on so many. I pass by them in my room and I'm like, oh, I want to work on the dragons or, oh, I want to work on this one. So <clears throat> that's why I want to get a little bit faster at it. So I could get more diamond paintings done and just stare at all the ones I finished. I hope you guys can't hear my stomach. I'm going to get off right now. I'm just going to put these away while I'm on camera. Because again, I just enjoy being with you all. Let's see. Let's put that one in. And that way when I turn off the camera, I don't have to do all this. And maybe I was able to keep someone company while they're diamond painting. Oh, I think the handle got caught. I know that's why some people don't like the handle because when you put this back in, it sometimes gets caught on that. Okay, so I got this in. <clears throat> it goes this way. Oh, does it go this way first? Oh no. <laughs> it goes like that, right? Oh yeah. I don't know, you guys. Oh yeah. Well, let's just put it on like this. <laughs> I'll fix that part later. So I do like these dust covers because they are material, but again, um, if they get wet, that's the only, my only concern. <clears throat> Oops, the diamonds are gonna slip out. Okay, so let me know in the comments if you're still here, if you have a YouTube channel, let me know. That way I could check out some YouTube channels those who are viewing. Oh, this one, I was going to say, this one just went right in, but let's see. Yeah, there we go. Let's just put all of this in. <clears throat> and then I guess you go like this. I believe I'm having trouble figuring out how to close this. So this, this has the logo, so that's going to go on top, right? And let's just close this up like that. I gotta, I gotta put all these videos together. I did like, I don't know, I stopped so many times because I'm coughing. See now, now I'm fine, and it's the end of the video. And I think that's why I just kind of stayed on here. <laughs> now I'm fine. It's the end of the video. Why does that happen? I was struggling so much <clears throat> during the video. Okay, well, you all have a great day. Remember to live a life filled with color because it's so much prettier that way. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.